dickheads what is going on today as you can see i'm gonna be reviewing parfums de marley pegasus now before i jump into this review guys i just want to say this bottle this bottle and this brand is the definition of quality guys you're paying big bucks you're gonna get big motherfucking benefits boy <laughs> Now, this bottle alone is like a pound. This cap alone is like a pound and a half. According to my calculations, that's like three and a half pounds. Three and a half pound bottle. That's heavy as hell. Let's jump straight into the smell test. I'm going to do this on skin because this fragrance is fucking awesome. Let's get to it. One more for good fucking measures. And I know y'all saw that atomizer. That shit right there is crazy. All right. Let's jump into this smell test. Oh, I'm quivering, bro. After that one, I just quivered. Oh, <laughs> no, but real talk, guys, this fragrance is fucking amazing. Like, you just, you get this almond nuttiness paired with this vanilla with a teeny weeny little bit of spiciness. And it just has this fucking mm, backbone of freshness that all perfumes to Marley fragrances seem to have. I smell, I'm giving this a solid 9.5 out of 10. The only reason it is not a 10 is because... I wish, personally, that it was more rich. I wish it didn't have as much cleanliness backbone, and it was more rich. So, that would make it a, uh, really a fall, winter type of fragrance. But this right here, versatile fragrance. I know a lot of people say this is already just a fall and winter exclusive fragrance. Now, I will say, this fragrance is great for those seasons, but it is also great for spring and summer daytime and evening this fragrance is extremely versatile in my humble opinion fuck what other people say and i would highly recommend it now we're gonna go into a uh, performance and projection guys it's parfums de marley they do some crazy shit with their chemical mixtures over there i don't know what they do but they just make it so that all of their fragrances are eight hours plus. You know, some of them are beast mode. This one is not what I would consider a beast mode fragrance. It is going to last you the whole day. I'm talking eight plus hours, but it is not going to last you like two fucking days, you know. Um, projection, guys. This is a moderate to loud projection. You're going to get three to four feet of projection within the first three hours of wearing it and it just it's such a nice aromatic pleasant handsome sexy scent bubble <laughs> it's great so performance and projection 8.5 out of 10 now moving on to price guys it is perfumes de marley they are a niche fragrance house it's a $310 uh, bottle of cologne. Guys, I have to give it a five just for the fact that it's so expensive. But now moving on to the overall rating, which getting into this, just to get this out of the way, since it is a niche fragrance house, I cannot, like, yeah, I just doesn't feel right to include the price as a factor because like, it's a niche fragrance. What do you expect for that? Like, do you expect a niche fragrance to be fucking cheap? No. So, guys, I'm going to balance out that 8.5 and that 9.5. And this fragrance is a solid fucking 9 out of 10. Solid, 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 solid 9 out of 10. Guys, I cannot recommend blind buying it just due to the price. If this was like 100 bucks, I would say fuck it go buy that shit but it's not a 100 bucks 
But what I will say is get off your lazy little YouTube watching ass and go smell this fragrance in Macy's or Nordstrom or Neiman Marcus or the Parfums de Marley Boutique, wherever you want to go, go smell this fragrance. It's worth the hassle. All right. It's worth it. And I think I think a lot of people are gonna like this fragrance. It's a it's not inoffensive, but at the same time, it's extremely unique. I haven't smelled a fragrance like this before. Nutty and vanilla -y and fresh and rich at the same time. So guys, nine out of ten on this fragrance. And that's all I got for y'all. Now, before I leave. Trust in God. Y'all stay blessed and pray every day because if you don't, I'm going to have to dig you down on some gangsta shit. You feel me? All right. Guys, as always, smell it before you buy it. And peace out, dickheads.